these are the fried pickles you talked about, right? They look like thin french fries. Center Square Tavern in Woolwich Township, New Jersey is the second venture for executive chef Jim Malaby. And it's still the focus is on great quality food. I've noticed that. Great quality food. Everything's made in house. Everything's right. made fresh every day. The chef features a farm to fork theme with a menu he describes as elegant casual. We feature a pork shank that's been seasoned overnight and then seared off and then it gets slow roasted for about six to eight hours until it falls off the bone. Oh, that sounds good. He's taking classics and giving them the center square spin. I like that there's creativity in it. Our motto is redefine the familiar. Like their corned beef beignets. Well, it's almost like you're eating a Reuben, but you don't have to mess with a messy sandwich. I've never heard of a hummingbird cake. It's a pineapple and banana, and mm. our recipe has a cream cheese mixture. I'm taking this home. The full bar features local brews, plus whimsical drink options. Center Square Martini, shimmering blue. You had me at blue shimmer. It's not on the menu. You have to secretly ask for it. So only our viewers know you have to ask for it. You don't have to go far to find a little bit of the city out in the burbs. Eat, drink, be square. New to the block in Conshohocken is imbibe food and drink by restaurateur Sean Weinberg. We really love the neighborhood here and love what's going on in Conshohocken. His latest venture features a contemporary American vibe, unlike the other two restaurants, Alba and Viga, which focus heavily on Italian style cooking. We brought our philosophy into it as far as sustainability and working with local farms and cooking seasonally. The space formerly occupied by Stella Blue is set to open this month with a spring-centered menu and a concentration on craft cocktails. It will be a place that certainly will be lively and fun, but there will also be little nooks so they can kind of tuck away into and have a nice romantic night. This right here is the jerk chicken platter. Miss Winnie's is bringing Jamaican flavor to downtown Westchester. Some people are scared by the term Jamaican food, but it's similar to barbecue. It's a father and son operation. I was born in Jamaica and came to the U.S. when I was around 15. With an ode to the family matriarch, Miss Winnie. She's welcoming to everyone. So in Miss Winnie's, we want to portray that same thing. You're here, you're welcome. One of the favorites in the family, this is the jerk pork with cabbage and rice and peas. There's a little something extra in the seasoning. Scotch bonnet peppers. So that's what brings on the heat and the jerk. There's also a unique menu posted on weekends only. The most exotic is the curry goat, but that's also one of the best. 